Hello children. Today's topic is about pronouns. Noun. Children, do you remember our first class on nouns? Let's look at this example. Anita is in my class. Who are we talking about here? Anita. Anita is a noun. So what is a noun? A noun is the name for person, place, animal and thing. Let's list some more nouns. Ramu, Anita, Ball. In this table, we have listed three nouns. Ramu, Anita and Ball. Ramu is a boy, Anita is a girl and Ball is a toy or a thing. In today's lesson, we are going to learn about pronouns. Now what is a pronoun? A pronoun is a word that takes the place of a noun. Like, I, me, you, we, she, he, it, him, her, it, us, they and them. These are all pronouns. Now let's go back to our table. So look at the nouns Ramu, Anita and Ball. Which other word can replace Ramu? As Ramu is a boy, we can say he. Replacing of a noun with another word is called a pronoun. A pronoun is a word that takes the place of a noun. So here, he will take the place of Ramu. Pronoun for Anita will be she. And pronoun for Ball is it. Let's understand these words more better in a sentence. Replace the highlighted noun with a pronoun. Let's use the same words we used in the above table. Ramu is a good boy. The highlighted noun here is Ramu. Replacing it with a pronoun would be He is a good boy. Anita is in my class. The highlighted noun here is Anita and replacing it would be She is in my class. I have a ball. The ball is my favorite toy. The highlighted noun here is ball. Replacing it with the pronoun would be I have a ball. It is my favorite toy. Look at this picture. It shows I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. These are the list of pronouns we use. Pronouns can be in singular and plural form. Let's look at some simple words and understand subject pronouns more better. Choose the correct pronouns using he, she, it or they. Look at the first picture. A teacher. A teacher becomes she because it is a female teacher. A rose becomes it. Group of friends changes to they. An elephant becomes it. Chefs changes to they because they are two. A farmer becomes he because it is a male farmer. Each pronoun can be placed in one of the categories. Now let's go into detail. In the first person we have I, me, my, mine, we, us, our, ours. This is the person who is speaking. In the second person we have you, your, yours. That will be the person spoken to. And then we have the third person. That will be he, his, him, she, her, hers, it, its, they, them, they are and theirs. This would be to the persons or things spoken about. What is a subject pronoun? We know that a pronoun is a word that takes the place of a noun. Subject pronouns come before the verb and do the action in a sentence. Every complete sentence has a subject, a verb and an object. The subject is always a person, place or thing. 
In this table, you will understand the singular and plural in first person, second person and third person. First person singular is I, me, my, mine, myself and first person plural is we, us, our, ourselves. Second person singular is you, your, yourself and second person plural is you, yours, yourselves. Third person singular is he, his, him, himself, she, her, herself, it, its, itself. And third person plural is they, them, they are, themselves. Notice the pronouns that are highlighted are those pronouns placed before the vowel. They are the subject pronouns. Let's see some examples. Fill in the blanks with the correct pronouns. John has many books. He likes to read. Lisa and I are friends. We play every day. A bird has wings. It can fly. Seema is a nurse. She looks after the sick. My name is Johnny. I like to travel. Replace the underlying nouns with pronouns. I asked Sam to come over and play. I asked him to come over and play. I helped my mother to do the dishes. I helped her to do the dishes. That big dog is my dog. That big dog is mine. Amul played ball with me and Rohini. Amul played ball with us. The teacher gave the students new pencils. The teacher gave them new pencils. Jack and Jill broke the toy. They broke it. That friend's house is for sale. Their house is for sale. The sandwiches are yours and mine. The sandwiches are ours.